Hi, you're right. This is Mike Wilkinson, and it's going to be good talking to you about the archons and the holographic world and other subjects. Um, it is my second video, so bear with me, and let's crack on with it. So we live inside um, a hexagram, which is which is a hologram. We have been worshiping Saturn all our lives, and we're not even aware of it because you don't even know what the symbols of Saturn are. We need to start decoding now. We are born into a free flowing sine waves reality and how Saturn and the moon projected square waves onto this reality which is a hologram. You can still move around in this hologram but it has limitations like time and space which spirit, which your spirits do not respond well to. We come from a free flowing sine wave reality that has infinite, infinitive potential. The Christian phrase for born into sin is born into sign. We have been hexed and inside the hexagram is a hidden symbol of the cube. One of the symbols for Saturn is the cube. Muslims worship the cube of Mecca. We put the cube on when we graduate. Jewish people use it to villain and many logos contain the cube. Like the TV, the phone and certain pizza boxes. It's endless. EL, Saturn, writes the code in our DNA. Carbon, the most important of the five elements, is composed of six protons, six neutrons, and six electrons, which is 666, which is the classic mark of the beast, which is the classic sign of the devil. On Earth, it used to be silica based, but that's another story, and I'll go into that on another video. So, I want to talk to you about the archons. The inorganic beings called Archons, they're a type of artificial intelligence that are in this reality that live within us. In Greek terms, Archons mean ruler or lords. These beings are rulers and enslavers of humanity. The Archons hide like energetic parasites in the depths of our psyche. They send currents of low frequency emotions and thoughts to our ego and our emotional bodies so they can latch onto a lower frequency energy that they can consume. This is their food. This is part of the reason why this matrix was set up, so these archons can keep being fed. Our shock art implants help them accomplish this even more. The false afterlife is a manipulation. The near-death experiences give us insight to this. The light that is discussed is an implant and captures you. It's too, be it's too beautiful and mesmerizing not to go into it. You simply can't look away. We've somehow been uploaded into this holographic matrix. Our original bodies exist on the other side of the plane through the vortex in the center. This hologram wasn't always like this. It was the golden age of Saturn until it was hacked by the low vibration entities. When it took over for power control and used as an 